something super exciting today I'm having a mommy daughter date with Coco and I if you did not know Coco is my French Bulldog she's currently three years old and I love her so much so basically mommy daughter day is basically like a bonding day with Coco and I where like I take her to the park I do like all these fun stuff with her and I and I'm so happy I filmed this video because I've had this on my schedule for the longest time and I finally filmed it but before we go on to the video, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I post new videos every week, so stay tuned. And I guess without further ado, let's go on to the video. So you guys, I'm in the car right now with Coco and we are on our way to PetSmart. This doggy, yes, look at her baby Coco. And we're on our way to PetSmart to go first to buy her food, see how she like interacts with like the animals because we usually don't take her to PetSmart because she gets super nervous. As you guys can see, she's like shaking right now. And yes, Coco is sitting on a blanket on top of me. Mostly because she sheds incredibly much. looking to finding her like a new leash like something like this because she, her leash that she has right now we've had it for like such a long time and it doesn't look that good anymore so we're trying to find her one we are going to try this one on her Buy two. Oh, get one, get one free. Buy one, get one free. Watch your have to go and drop me so crazy. Now I'm feeling lost without you, and I just hate it. Oh my god. So this is all in PetSmart. This is so cute. Oh my god, this is my favorite one. Every night, every day is a happy holiday. Okay you guys, right now I am taking Coco to the dog park. As you guys can see, everything is very dog related here. So Usually in dog parks, Coco gets super nervous because she's super overprotective and she starts like screaming at all the other dogs, like, you know, barking. But yeah, right now we're going to be taking her to the dog park and yeah, let's see how this goes. See Coco. Coco, we are going. Go, you're free.
Um, that'll be it. All right, you can just come to the window. Thank you. All right, perfect. Thank you. I just ordered Starbucks for Coco and I and we are super excited. I have given Coco like a few puppuccinos here and there and she actually likes them a lot. Coco and I are waiting in the line right now to get her puppuccino. It's not that long because we're basically right there but... Coco, your puppuccino. Okay, you guys, I have here my puppuccino. This is actually Coco's. So let's see how she reacts to it. This is how it looks inside. It's literally just whipped cream. But let's see if she likes it. She hardly has even a nose, so she can't reach to this cup. <laughs> And that was Coco's experience with her puppuccino. As you guys can tell, she's on another level right now. So happy, look at her, I can't even believe this. So yes, that was Coco at Starbucks. And now let's go on to our next stop. Alrighty guys, I'm in Publix right now. I'm trying to find the lean beef so I can make it for Coco today for her dinner. I'm super excited because I usually cook her meat even though I try not to eat so much meat but either way she's going to be eating that today and I'm super excited so how about we just go get it right now let's see I really don't know which one to get because I don't I don't really shop in this meat section so it's just super odd for me Alrighty guys, so I decided to get Coco some lean ground beef which is actually pretty good because you can't eat so much fat That's what I'm gonna get her Alrighty you guys Right here, I have my two meats. These are both for Coco. If you guys are probably asking yourself, why do you cook for your dogs? And it's mostly because I feel like I actually know what's going into like their diet and everything. It's warming up the pan. I'm not sure if you guys can see. <laughs> Bro, it's just... I saw like a video that saying I have to flip it with this, but I don't know when I need to flip it. We're gonna figure that out today together you know i honestly don't know what i'm doing if you want me to be completely honest like this is kind of crazy for me so this is what my pan looks like right now okay so i think the meat is finally ready this is coco's meat that she will be eating today I honestly should let this cool down before I give it to her. How Coco's meal looks. As you guys can see, we have all these little grains that are for her, that her vet recommended. And then here is all her meat. Usually she doesn't even eat this, so let's put her in her plate right now. It's literally been the longest day ever. And that's pretty much it for today's video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys loved this video as much as I loved filming it. And if you did, make sure to give this video a huge like and comment down below what video you'd like to see next. 
And of course, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I guess I'll see you all next week. But for now, bye guys. Oh, 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 oh,